Hi guys, and thanks for clicking on my video. Today I'll be painting up my Laukovai kitbash. If you want to see how she came together, check out my previous tutorial, How to Kitbash Laukovai. I'll be using Vallejo paints, as always. The colours this time are black, warlord purple, bloody red, bone white, and white. Laukovai has already been zenithal highlighted, so she's got some contrast, but I want her undertones to be red and bloody. So I'll start with a wash of red mixed with a bit of black. I did a second coat to darken her up a bit as well. And after drying with a hairdryer, I dry brushed some bone white and then white on top of that. To make the model look more fleshy, I washed over with Warlord Purple mixed with black. Oh, and I forgot to mention I'm using a little bit of gold to detail the metal bits, which I darkened up with a black wash. Now I'm going in with my small pointy brush and painting some detail onto the skin with bone white. I painted some detail onto the face with regular white as well. Then I went back to darken up the skin, focusing on the areas I wanted to look more raw, like the skin that's all tight and stretched over the wings.
on taking blood red and slathering it all over the sharp bits, letting it drip down into pools on the base. I went back to the wings and did some more with my Warlord Purple Black Mix and Bone White. Then I was ready to move on to the base. I'm using Vallejo Earth Texture Acrylic for the first time. It acts like mud for your bases, and I actually really like the way this turned out. I think I'll be using it again. It's very easy to use. I dried it a bit and stuck on some grass tuff from War World Scenic and Gamers Grass. Then I glued some dried lichen from Amazon with PVA. She wouldn't be complete without pools of blood. So I'm just going to let some thinned down blood red drip down from her claws and pull onto the mud. I also stuck on a little torso left over from Corpse Cart for gory effect. So let's take a look at the model now. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. She's giving me some 80s horror poster vibes and I think she looks kinda heavy metal as well. She's definitely much more vibrant than my usual grimdark style, even though she's still very gruesome. Let me know in the comments below how you'll be painting your Laukavai, or Vangorian Lord, and if you've kitbashed your models as well. Give me a like if you liked it, and subscribe for more content. See you next week!